We are creating an airline here today that has a far brighter future than either of us individually could have ever created on our own. I think it's really important to go back and examine the performance of our respective companies here recently. Both of our companies are on a very competitive trajectory. So uh, this is not a defensive combination of companies. This is a combination of companies that creates future opportunity. This is not a merger predicated on increasing fares. This is a merger predicated on being more competitive and more global and providing an unparalleled network for scope and scale attractive to both business travelers, who are very high yield business travelers, and, con and general consumers and leisure travelers. In, it, we don't expect any significant loss in frontline jobs. Uh, clearly in a merger where, where you have overlapping general administrative expense, that's part of the logic of a merger, and that will occur. Uh, we're, not, uh, you know, we're not in a position to know precisely the number of jobs or will it be located. Uh, in the corporate headquarters, uh, current corporate headquarters of, of, of Houston, there will be some job loss. In the headquarters of, of United, there will be some job loss. Uh, to, together, however, we will be more competitive. And, you know, Glenn and I will treat our, our employees as...